In this video, we're going to be working through these three examples. So let's start off with the first one. So 895 plus 86. So make sure the tens column and the units column match up like that. And then I'm going to put the plus there. So 5 plus 6 is 11. So I write down the 1 from the units of 11. And then I've got the 1 from the tens. Okay. So we should read 11 like that. Then we've got 9 plus 8, which is 17, plus the 1 that I have there, which is 18. So I put down the 8, and I carry the 1. Then I've got 8 plus nothing plus 1 is 9. So we should get 981. OK. When you're practicing these, probably a good shout just to check your answers on your calculator, just so you can check that you've got the right answer. Uh, number 2. We have 6,543 plus 932. So I'm matching up the units column, the tens, and the hundreds. 3 plus 2 is 5. 4 plus 3 is 7. 5 plus 9 is 14. So put down the 4, carry the 1. 6 plus 1 is 7. So we have 7,475. OK, last one. So we have 58,392 plus 47,426. OK, so we have 2 plus 6 is 8. 9 plus 2 is 11, so 1, carry the 1. 3 plus 4 is 7, plus the 1 is 8. 8 plus 7 is 15, so 5, carry the 1. 5 plus 4 is 9, plus the 1 is 10. So we put down the 0, and essentially you're carrying the 1, but there's nothing left to write there. You can put the 1 there if you like, but we've got 0 plus 1, which is just 1. And so our answer is 105,818.